Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm Helen. Today I want to talk to you about the structure happen to do something. Happen to do something means to do something by chance. Let's look at some simple sentences. I didn't mean to eavesdrop. I just happened to hear you talking. And let's break this sentence down into parts. I didn't mean to means I didn't intend to listen, right? I didn't listen to you talking intentionally. So it just happened, right? I didn't mean to eavesdrop. I didn't mean to eavesdrop. And eavesdrop means to secretly listen to someone's conversation. Ugh, you were eavesdropping? Sorry, I don't mean to eavesdrop on the conversation. And I happen to hear it means I heard it by chance. And I just happen to hear that you have an extra ticket. And I just happen to hear her speak at a big data conference at Harvard. Another good word for hearing what other people are saying without intending to is over here. So over here is like, listen to somebody's conversation but not intending to do it, not wanting to. I happen to overhear the name of the winner of... Forgive me for overhearing. I'm sorry, we didn't mean to overhear, but... In the church, I don't know, I happen to just overhear this. And I hear them saying that... Another example. How did you meet? Oh, we just happened to be sitting next to each other at the conference. I wasn't planning to buy anything, I just happened to have some cash on me. When we went to Spain, we happened to meet our friends there. He happened to be here at the right time. It means he was lucky enough to be here at the right time. Happen to do something is also often used for asking something politely. For example, do you happen to know where the bus stop is? Or do you happen to know where I can park my car? Do you happen to know? Do you happen to have a pen? Do you happen to have a can opener? Do you happen to have that number? Do you happen to have any information about it? You happen to have five dollars. And sometimes it's put like this. You don't happen to know where Jamie is, do you? You don't happen to know where Jamie is. And here's the question tag. Do you? You don't happen to know where Jamie is, do you? You don't happen to have a breath mint on you, do you? <laughs> and be very careful with the grammar in such questions. Compare these two questions. What time does the cafe open? Do you happen to know what time the cafe opens? Do you happen to know what time the cafe opens? Compare these two questions. Where is the bus stop? Do you happen to know where the bus stop is? Don't mess up the grammar. I hope it was useful for you and see you in my next video.